Moonlight Shadow by Mike Oldfield. The kind of song you hear on the radio when it's inside of your head for the rest of the day. Beautiful song, and I think it was a big hit in Europe. Number one song as well. But the thing I find personally quite interesting in this performance here, performance, it's obviously not live, is uh, the bass player. Huh? He looks a bit uh, scary, or perhaps that there's a bit of drugs involved. Now. The song starts off with a very recognizable little intro played by Oldfield and goes something like this. And then it starts, of course. Beautiful little intro. And what's interesting is, we all know that we can mute the bottom strings with the palm of the right hand, right? But it's not very common to do that same technique on the top strings and the middle strings, but it does have a unique sound. Beautiful. Oh, this is a bit difficult. Now the basic meat and potatoes of the song is actually very, very easy. The trees Now the song only has four basic easy chords, A minor, the F, which can be a bit tricky of course. I like to do the F like this, that's a bit less of a hassle to grab this chord. G and C. And that's it, that's all you need. all there is to it. Now there's one other part and that's it. That's the entire song. It only has two parts. And that second part, the bridge, if you will, has a certain thing that reminds me of Jumping Jack Flash. But the Stones. But in this song it's like Now, before you think, well, this is just too easy, well, there is the small matter, of course, of the guitar solo. Now, what I like about his guitar solo is, he could have easily done something like, something minor, pentatonic, and let it roll type of a guitar solo. But instead, he does something that is much more melodic. What a beautiful, beautiful melody. What a great way to start. And what he does basically is just, he's playing chords. Goes on to a little country band. Back to the chords, and, and, and on top of those chords you just embellish and play melodies. together. And that's something that reminds me of something that Eric Clapton used to say. Whenever you play a guitar solo, try to avoid playing just one note at a time. All the time. Every now and then, two notes together. And that makes it a lot more interesting and that's something that Mike Oldfield does here all the time. Back to the chords. Then he goes very, very, very high. Wow. And here comes the fun part. A very fast lick. Let me first play it very slow. <laughs> wow. 
and then fast. Yeah, that's nice. Thank you, Oldfield. starts to play with lots more distortion, as you can tell. Basic, very common licks. But what's not so common is this bend. Wow! Middle finger, pinky, ah, that's gonna hurt a little bit. Because you also have to be pitch perfect. If it's slightly off, which is very easy to do, then it doesn't sound well. So you have to be spot on. Well, this is definitely not a guitar solo for the beginner guitarist, but you can find the taps if you need them, of course, on my Patreon site. Let's do it together. Let's play the guitar solo of Moonlight Shadow. 